So this um, video will show you the process on how to scan the phosphor plates through the ScanX machine, which will then enter the DEXIS system. So first off, you need to double click into DEXIS. If you had a client booked into the Dentrix system, you would go through the client's chart and then click on the DEXIS tab at the bottom of the screen in the patient's chart, which would bring you into the DEXIS system. It integrates together. Today we're just going to find our client, so DHX-ray 1. We'll choose that client by double clicking. Brings you into the DEXIS software. You have to click on the play button, which is the triangle, sideways triangle. And then click start. You can see that right now the words are gray or the writing is yellow and it's in a gray box. As soon as I press start, that should turn green. That gives you the okay to go ahead. It also lights up the ScanX machine to show you that it's ready to accept the actual phosphor plate. The phosphor plate is then removed from the transfer box. There's four different sections that you could place the phosphor plate in. The word should be facing you and then just push down and as you're doing that it shows up red so it's letting you know that you can't put another x-ray through that number one slot until it turns green again. The teeth should that the film should then, or the image should then pop up onto this pop-up screen where it asks you to assign the teeth. And I took the maxillary right premolar area, so I will highlight those specific teeth, and then I'll say set teeth of selected. And now I have the 1-4 to the 1-6 here on the top. And then I'll press done. We will then see that our PA will be mounted in the right area on top of the previous one. Okay, so you always have to look at the date. We can go ahead and hide some of the older ones if we want to so to make it easier for the dentist to see. But Traditionally, this is how it will look as soon as you have that um, phosphor plate scanned and the image will show. And that concludes how to use the ScanX machine.